Oops. Hey there. Oh, I am recording. Okay. Um, so I have uh, Laurel Wood Brewing Company's Organic Tree Hugger Porter. Um, so um, points for organic, points for tree hugger, points for Portland, Oregon. Um, so apparently they're established in 2001, and I think that the last time I went up there and I was trying to do a Portland brewery tour, I missed them. So um, shucks. I'm going to have to go back. It also says that... Um, they use 100% organically grown barley malts to fuel this environmentally friendly fermentation. I don't know if there's um, non-environmentally friendly fermentation, but there it is. Um, so let's let's get in on this. Yeah, you get this lovely. Um, mm, I always think it's dusty smell that porter has, but it's like this deep kind of um, burnt, almost acrid smell, which always makes my mouth water, which seems contrary, but there it is. Um, anyway, lots of malt. Mm. And that little tinge of like grape juice smell that I always get out of this mid-range beer, beer, um, the mid-range beer area, and uh, it's great. All right, super black. Little, actually, there's a little bit of light getting through. I don't see a lot of carbonation, but it did pour with a good head and it did persist. Um, which is awesome. So here we go, flavor. Mm. Yeah, I heart porters. So bitter, but bitter in the multi way, um, which I think is is always really interesting because I, I know people tend to uh, try to find multi beers in order to avoid bitterness uh, and porter and stouts really em embrace that bitterness so it's got that kind of french roast coffee um, flavor to it but then behind that is this nice depth of malt complexity that's really enjoyable um, And the aftertaste is nice and light um, and is, is very drinkable again. Sometimes I feel like when I have a porter, like you get that kind of bitter aftertaste and then it takes a couple of moments to work up the courage to have another drink. Um, but this is a very drinkable beer. Um, hmm. Mouthfeel, um, it's a medium, pretty full body beer um it actually is pretty sparkly um carbonation uh even though you don't see it in the glass um but very enjoyable uh so my overall impression is that this is a really really great um porter so if you like that kind of deep almost smoky um quality out of beers i definitely rec recommend that you try this um good beer um, all right, so out of Portland, Oregon, I happen to get this in my Tavor shipment, um, but I would love to hear from you where you were able to find it. If you have tried, if you have tried it, share with me down below so we can all find it. Um, and then this is 5.8% alcohol by volume and listed as 30 IBUs. Um, and then my phone timed out. Um, and I haven't been looking to see how those come in um, in the ranges. So what did I say? 5.8%. So the range for the style is 4.8 to 6.5, and then the IBUs from 22 to 50, 25 to 50, which is a pretty um, large range, but they stick themselves, um, you know, nicely in the middle. Um, but very well done um, brew out of Oregon. Portland makes some really slamming beers, but I feel like I need to take a road trip up there soon to try some more. So um, there you go. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good night.